bless the day to you. Have you, have you wondered what it is to be a woman? I think men wonder it often. <laughs> because they I often hear men go like, you can't understand them. <laughs> Just, you got to love them. You can't understand them. But sometimes women even wonder, what is it to be a woman? And my children, you know, they always come to a stage where they are growing up and becoming women. Um, they no longer want to, they not, not no longer want to be girls, but they are growing up to be women. And now they ask, so what is it to be a woman? And I have been asking God this, and there's this wonderful scripture, and my, many of us will know it, Proverbs 31, and you always talk, about the Proverbs 31 woman. And when I read the scripture, I always know that I probably can't get to that ever. <laughs> but it's just, if you read that whole piece of scripture, it's just beautiful. And I imagine it as a as a mother of a son trying to show him they're in a banqueting hall and they're standing up and she's looking down and she's going, you see that girl, she's like this. And you see, and she's trying to teach her son what, um, values to look for in a woman and she says charm is deceitful and beauty is vain but a woman who fears the Lord is to be praised that's Proverbs 31 verse 30 charm is deceitful and beauty is vain but a woman who fears the Lord is to be praised oh, wonderful a woman who fears the Lord is to be praised doesn't mean she can't be charming or beautiful um, it just means that if her main aspect is those two things charm and beauty then there's an emptiness because a woman who is filled by God a man who is filled by God anybody who is filled by God is to be praised because you are filled with that which is praiseworthy Wow that is, a, that is a big thing, I think. And a lot of people might struggle with that. I do a lot. I don't think I'm worthy. Um, I don't think I'm charming or beautiful either. But I try hard to be filled by God. But it's a daily, and I, I don't want to say struggle. It's a daily labor. But it's a labor that you do with pleasure because the the fruits of your labor are just so immense and so big and so real. The only real labor is for God. The rest is almost like charm and beauty because it's deceitful and vain. Beauty is vain, but that which God has placed in you to be beautiful towards others, that is is absolutely valuable when you can look at somebody with love and you use love instead of charm you draw people towards you and you can only do that if God has loved you first and to be loved you have to accept that love so charm is deceitful and beauty is vain a woman who fears the Lord is to be praised. I want to say a person, anybody who is filled with God, who fears the Lord, is to be praised. Women are precious. Men are precious. Because our God loves us. And he is king. Can you go... And be filled so that you can be praised because you have Christ. I'm going to try today. Have a wonderful day and we'll speak again tomorrow.